Hey there, everyone. This is Rao Cow playing Super, Mar Super Mario Infinity. That's it. Last time we've accomplished World 5 and we're starting World 6 now, sir. No uh, pressure. But you did say that the game became interesting and stuff and thing and stuff starting World 6 and we're in World 6. No pressure, but we're starting Merry Meadow 1. It's a yellow stage, but I'm expecting a lot. Oh my god, okay, well. Mission accomplished, there's a big dude. I'm... Oh boy, that is not a good sign. That is not a good sign. <laughs> wow, these destroy sponge worm blocks instantly. That's good to know, I guess. <laughs> okay, what do you have to say here? Blue blicks like these will break more easily than green ones. Pay attention to color! Oh, well, that explains that. Okay. Uh, okay. Well then, let me consult my Pokédex regarding these. These are flammable blocks. Well, ain't that sweet. Mario blocks can be passed by you and not by enemies, but only enemies can pass through Mario blocks with the next over them. Th that's just... okay, so that's a Mario's are not wanted type thing. Uh, I, whoa! Boomerang Bill! Boomerang Bill! Off for blood! Kind of running around and trying to beat me with a mallet. Wait, I can't. I can't stand on these at all. That's kind of dumb. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, this is indeed getting rather interesting, if not that shit insane. Um. <laughs> oh, my fireballs can't pass either. Fireballs are not Mario or Luigi, I guess. Yeah, those are Mario blocks. Why can't Luigi pass without a hitch? That's discriminant. I can't. Oh, for the love of God! <laughs> That's actually kind of clever. Oh, what? Free can thing, Bob George. I am filling myself, my soul, with big white bubble of rage. Oh yes, if there existed somewhere in the world. An internet macro that <coughs> that will explain my my rage type area. I, I'd so be posting it somehow by video. I'm not too sure how that would work. Probably some clever clever usage of headphones. Whoa! What the hell? <laughs> oh no! I've been caught by the sky somehow. Um. Sometimes it's best not to ask too many questions. You just kind of sit there. Put on your tie, hang up your halo, and and enjoy the ride. And do not ask questions. Do not ask questions. Is that a question I'm hearing here? It better not be, because <laughs> there's going to be blood to pay. Well, this is interesting and filled with cheese. Jumping, jumping into coin heaven. Technically, coin heavens are an interesting reward. They're just not that great for LP materials. Alas, LP is not exactly normal gameplay, so maybe it's not. It, this is not technically Reading's fault. It's my fault for for refusing to wear jeans like my 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 min not my minions, my peers. There's a big difference between minions and peers. It's well, sometimes it gets confusing because of a somewhat relation type thing we have going on, but that's no excuse to start pooing on parrots. Parrots are awesome. Well, kind of awesome. They're, they're, they're palatable. It is a polite way of saying it. Wh what's down here? There's not death at all. Hey there, guys. How's it going? Hey, that that thing fell. That's that's super. Okay. Uh, hey there, Goomba guy. Then, okay. So these are blocks. This is getting confusing. This is getting confusing. Um, so why exactly did Reading wait until this level to start these little interesting, strange gimmick things? Seriously, guy? There's a shell. That's curious. And nothing to use on. Hey there, both Bill. That's a normal bill. It's not a boomerang bill. Mm, maybe they shouldn't be called both bills, but... Oh, I just, just got enough time to play another level and hopefully it'll be just as worthwhile. Like. This was an interesting introduction type thing, but it was an interesting introduction type thing, you know? 
Merry Meadows 2. It's a Merry and it's a Meadow. I don't know why, I'm not too sure what a Meadow exactly entails. Okay, well, oh, it's an old scrolling. Oh, hey, it's Velcro Grass and the Hammer Brother right in the beginning. Um, I'm screwed. Well, um, guess I can tank it. I'm gonna get this feather. Regardless, I guess not. Velcro Grass, Velcro Grass, and we're stuck in the underground bunker part. Kind of moving forward, which is better than moving backward, I guess, depending on your point of view regarding ant farming. I'm rather neutral on that particular subject myself, but uh, I must not assume uh, expertise amongst everyone regarding everything that I may mention. This is harder than it should. Um, go faster, go faster, go faster scrolling. Oh, freaking Hammer Brothers, they're always such a pain. Uh, just leave me alone! Whoa! He's passed out. He doesn't like being told th stuff. I have found your secret weakness to to tell me you to leave me alone. That's one hell of a weakness you got there, guy. That's one hell of a weakness. Personally, I would worry somewhat. I'm gonna take the underground part because it's gonna make me escape these sliding dudes. And God, those sliding dudes are just trouble, trouble and inter. What? Okay. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Suddenly the field has become all metallic. I won't ask too many questions because then that's it. Wow, that was... Well, that sure was a level. Of course, Clay or an onus, as always, and that's, that's it for tonight. Uh, I guess that's it for tonight. <laughs> This is Rao Cow that just played Super Mario Infinity for the bowling alley. Um, join me next time tomorrow for more ROM hacking action type platforming. And uh, Noldar and your wife, have a good night on my behalf. And I guess I'll... yeah. I guess I'll... yeah. Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, Huzza, uh, thank you for letting me break your... S A cherry as it was, although Hunza is more of a deceased crab type of reference. But I'll let it pass this time because you gotta get a free coupon ticket. So here's a free coupon. Enjoy, don't eat it in one bite.